I decided on Southeast Asia, Japan, China because it's just so different. Everything is so unique, everyone's so different than what you'd expect. Completely different kinds of minds behind the architecture, behind the culture, behind the art. It's amazing. Um, best trip so far I think was the Japan trip. The Japan trip was, I feel, the most diverse in its in its ac activities mm -hmm. and in its, um, well, in its culture. It was, it was amazing. The tour guide was great. The view was fantastic for the, the time of year to do everything was mm -hmm. perfect. Done all three trips so far. Southeast Asia, which included Thailand, uh, Vietnam, Laos and Cambodia. Mm -hmm. I've also done the Japan trip and I'm currently on the China trip. In Vietnam we went to this place called Paradise Cave. Amazing place. It was a massive, massive cave. The, the cave has been sitting there for millions of years and you find all these amazing like stone structures and, and like that the stalactites and stalagmites have created, mm -hmm. and you go through all the like all the way through like a mile, I think, and it's all, it's all lit up in different colours, making amazing shadows, amazing images. It just it's beautiful. Like, it's the most breathtaking place I've ever been to. In Japan and Southeast Asia, there was a lot more commercial stuff. There was a lot more like tourism stuff. But in China, there's I mean, obviously in Southeast Asia there was. Paradise Cape was amazing, but in that was in a small place. You look over China and you see all these amazing like mountain structures that you just you wouldn't see anywhere else, and they're all covered in amazing luscious green like jungles. It looks beautiful. For the Southeast Asia, I'd have to say, Survey was my favorite guide. He was entertaining. He got along great with the group. Um, he knew quite a bit about the uh, about each place we went to. He was very knowledgeable. He kept the place running smoothly.